I've been sitting here in silence, <laughs> contemplating what the bloody heck I should talk about. I just want to make a video. So just sitting down, doing nothing, wasting time, wasting precious time. And I just want to make a video. I did. It's like, I was like, I got time. I got some time. I got a little bit of time. A little bit of writer's block, you know. Can't, uh, stores are cooking. Sto I got stores cooking, guys. I got, I got, I got movies, shorts, cooking, stewing, mixing up all up in here. You can't see them, though. I'm the only one who can see them. You will eventually. Hopefully. Hopefully. Let me tell you, hopefully. Hopefully, eventually, I will get these to my computer like this, then print them out, then people can read them. And then with the device for which I'm recording this video, either this one here or one similar, I can record those events that I write down that other people are uh, reenacting, and then someone or myself can uh, uh, splice, 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 or so, perhaps so, uh, those, those, that footage, that those pictures and whatnot, those moving pictures, sew them together, and then uh, slap them on YouTube, and then you can see it. I think that is the perfect analogy for filmmaking. I see no other possible, realistic, or more accurate a description. I'm an idiot. I shaved and I cut my hair. Not because of the video itself and like I was embarrassed about the way I look because I look good. No, I just, it was, it's hot. It's been hot lately and having shorter hair and a shorter beard helps with, with heat. I still have to have the beard though. I can't get rid of it fully. I look like uh, an, an idiot. When I was heavier, I looked horrible when I shaved. Have you ever seen Bugs Bunny? Anybody here? Anybody? Bugs Bunny? Bugs Bunny? There was, there's this one episode where there's like this gangster, he's like, like a little gangster guy, and he has like this henchman uh, that walks around with him. I look like him when I shaved. I look like a big old dopey henchman. Mm-mm. -hmm. So if I can help it, I don't shave. It's better now, because I lost some weight. <laughs> I'm writing now. I'm, I'm writing things, hopefully writing more. I have plans. I uh, wrote something last night, nearly done with it. I think it'll be a nice little short. Not telling you what it is, I don't want people stealing my ideas. I saw a movie yesterday, Poltergeist. No words of inspiration for that, like Tomorrowland. But I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. I had fun. That's what a movie should do. You should just, you should, you should just have more better movies sometimes. You don't have to think too much. Thinking is sometimes a negative thing. I find it is. Sometimes I think too much and then I decide to make a video. One should not always say just act. You should think before you act. Just maybe not think too much. Think the appropriate amount. Thinking the appropriate amount is always a good thing to do. So have you have you been, my seven subscribers? Have you shared? The, have you shared? I'm just curious. You don't have to, but if you find me at all entertaining, go ahead and share me. You know, give you know, send this video to your to your to your grandma, to your to your pappy, or perhaps uh, single attractive females. This is a um. Lens cap. <laughs> I forgot the name of the lens cap. In five whole seconds. It's a light. There's no bulb in it. But that's what's lighting this thing we're using this. So educational. What the heck am I doing? This is nonsense. Never let me make a video like this again. Never let me do this again. This is I should do something with coins. No, I 
I shouldn't shut it off. <laughs> I wish I had some questions to answer. I've got, okay, there was one, <laughs> there was one question on my first video, and I know who asked it. So I guess I'll answer it now. Someone asked, who are some of my favorite YouTubers? Owen Rogers is obviously one. One of the first YouTubers I ever started watching uh, was uh, Corey Vidal of Apprentice A. Uh, it, 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 was, it was five years ago. I started watching five years ago. And he, did, he started daily vlogs. And that has been the big inspiration for me because uh, from that time on, I wanted to start a YouTube production company. Production. A YouTube production company. I uh, wanted to start a uh, YouTube production company because that's what he does with, with all of his friends. And I was like, that life looks so cool and fun. And his vlogs are very, they, they're very funny, they're very emotional, they're very exciting. You see a lot of cool things. They travel the world in them, and that's very cool. And I find that very, like, I want to do that. Uh, so, hey, why not? I'm going to thank you, Corey Vidal and Brandon Say, for making the videos you have and uh, being a part of inspiring me in my own journey. You, I've watched you all through my college years. From 2010 to 2005, I've watched you guys. Uh, so, thanks. Uh, another uh, one of my favorite YouTubers, one of my favorite people, uh, is uh, the Shea Tards and Shea Carl. I admire that guy so much. He is he is someone that I, in my personal life, want to be like. Um, one of the kindest men I've ever seen. Uh, no, I don't know him personally, but from everything I hear from other people, he is exactly how he is on the internet. And uh, he's, he's just a good-hearted, kind man, and uh, kudos to him for everything he's gotten because he he deserves it, and I enjoy watching his family. They're so funny. I really do enjoy them. And he, he, I'll, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna go out here too and say, hey, Sh Shay. Uh, <laughs> that's weird. I could actually be talking to Shay Carl also. That's weird. I could be talking to these people for all I know. They could actually be watching this. Hey, how's it going? Uh, but Shay, uh, I want to thank you for helping me lose uh, 60 pounds uh, two years ago. I haven't lost any since. But I did lose 60 pounds, and that was a huge part of, uh, from you. So thank you, uh, if you see this at all. Uh, yeah, Apprentice A, Shay Carl, Weezy Waiter's a great YouTuber. And uh, his friend Jake um, Jarvie, Jake Jarvie of Pops, uh, is a great YouTuber as well. Not as well known, but he, he kind of goes into the realm of kind of what I want to do. So if you want to see, like, the, the, a long series um, where it's a basically a film a season he, he's done how many has he done like eight or nine seasons of a show called pops and it's about these superheroes really cool check out pops that's definitely the kind of stuff that i want to do in terms of length and format definitely uh and even story you know, funny adventurous stuff like that i'd love to do i like i like vlogs and i like content um content in terms of a narrative content i love narrative content and vlogs are in and of themselves a narrative that I uh, really do enjoy uh, watching and getting to see uh, some people's lives and it's it, they edit themselves and they're showing they're telling you the story that they want to tell and, and, and I really do enjoy them and the mo majority of the time they're funny it's, it's hard to watch a lot of vlogs but um, I watch some and the ones I do watch I enjoy I don't know maybe I should end this video that, that's a, those are some of my favorite YouTubers uh, that, I've, that I've liked for the longest time look up to to some extent and I uh, would like to I would and, and forget Owen Rogers man <laughs> I couldn't say enough about Owen Rogers in terms of what he does and his personal life I look up to him greatly as well so yeah I'm gonna end this video this nonsensical rubbish spewing video that I just wanted to make because I wanted to make something and if you want to make something make it as long as it's not some sort of diabolical device that is used to take over the world. Don't do that unless you're like a really good person and you just want to take over the world because you truly are going to make it better. Which could be, I mean, hey, hey, who am I to judge? Okay, so I danced at the end of the last video. I danced. What should I do this time? How should I end this video? How should I? Uh, if you could, people comment on the bottom how I should end this video. That doesn't help me now 
at all. Slot my knee. That's how I end this video. No. This is gonna be a heck of a time to edit. <laughs> It'll be fun. I gotta listen to my voice for however long I record it. It'll be great. It'll be great. I feel like I should dance again. I'll just do a chair dance. Just a little shoulder. But hey, if you if you want to if you do want to send video to any attractive single females, I am single myself. Very.